We're here in Burnley Town Centre at the former Lavery Night nightclub. They've redeveloped this particular venue into 26 apartments and we're going to have an exclusive tour around. This is a project that Burnley can be very proud of. We're going to meet local lad and contractor Mick Cookson who in turn uses several Burnley companies during this project. Mick took us on an exclusive behind the scenes tour. So could you just explain a bit about who he's working on this project? This project is manned by all Burnley people. It's aimed at Burnley people and all the staff on this particular project are all from Burnley. All the craftsmen join us, all the manufacturing people who make all the windows are all Burnley people. The plumbing companies are from Burnley, the joinery company is actually on site joining us. They're all Burnley, Burnley teams. They're not from one company. They're all from separate line or three man operators, which is, it gives everybody a piece of the cake. The development is scheduled to finish in round about uh, May. I mean, we have 40 men on site at the moment. In, there's, they're all over the place. You, you probably notice every room there's somebody working. Oh, this particular room here is your living room. It's a good size, this one. This is this used to be the VIP lounge. And just to summarise um, what we've been doing, this, this used to be an existing nightclub for Lumen Leisure, Larvig Night. We've developed 26 luxury apartments on three floors to create a really unique living space for people of Burnley. Um, aimed at a young market possibly because there's a help to buy scheme in place. <laughs> Most of the apartments have got full appliances in, washing machine, dryer, fridge freezers, ovens, hobs, all the usual things, fully furnished bathrooms, and they'll be all carpeted as well. So, you know, you've just got to put your furniture in and away you go. Credit to everyone doing this during the pandemic. What kind of support have you received from Burnley Council? Just in the last six months, it's been, it's been really good and they've really got things moving for us. Uh, there were a few delays at the beginning due to the fact it's a listed building, you can understand that. But once we got to the council and we spoke to them direct, I think they, they, they realised that you know the investment's too big not to be in, involved heavily. And they've got heavily involved behind and they've pushed the job on, which has made things a lot easier for me and my partner. People definitely invest in Berlin. When they see, this, when they see these sort of buildings being put together, people will invest. Like I said, my partner's in London, he's in Dorset, he's at the, he couldn't go any far down the country, he tried. He just bought this building because he loved the building. This is the place to be at the minute, I think, this time. There's lots and lots of opportunity here, lots of opportunity. Just at this moment in time, it's a vibrant time, you know. A lot of investment, a lot of going on in the town, a lot of new construction going on in this town, a lot of new housing estates going up everywhere, so it's bringing, there's more people obviously coming to live in Burnley. There's a lot of outside interest, definitely, in these apartments in Manchester due to the fact it's five minutes to the motorway.